Good morning. This is Pastor Jason of Kona Faith Center with a word for today. And the word for today is desire. My heart's desire is to reap the harvest. I have seen the fields are wide unto harvest. The harvest is plentiful. There are so many people that need Jesus to be their Lord, their master. Jesus set the example on how to reap the harvest. Preach the gospel, heal the sick, cast out demons, reap the harvest. And he has sent me, he's also sent you, but he has sent me to preach the gospel, heal the sick, cast out demons, reap the harvest. Help me, Jesus. Help me, Holy Spirit. I recognize that I need to be the new man, put on the new man to hold the new wine of the Holy Spirit who empowers the preaching of the gospel, who heals the sick, who casts out demons, who brings the divine revelation of Jesus. The testimony of the Lord is sure. Testify of yourself, Lord, with signs, wonders, miracles, and gifts of the Holy Spirit. Now, for me, it always starts with the Word. The Word of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. Isn't that interesting? The testimony of the Lord is sure. The Word makes wise the simple. The word of the Lord is right and brings joy. Thank you, Jesus. The word of the Lord is pure. It brings enlightenment. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The fear of the Lord is clean. It cleanses our hearts so that we can preach, heal, deliver. The judgments of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. In keeping them is great reward. He's a rewarder. He's not a withholder. Help me keep the words in my mouth and the meditation of my heart acceptable in your sight, Lord, so that you can give me the desires of my heart. Thank you, Lord, for granting me my heart's desire and fulfilling all my purpose. Thank you, Lord, for your anointing. Thank you, Lord, that you answer. Thank you, Lord, that you have given me my heart's desire and not withheld my request. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord, that you bless me with the blessings of goodness. Thank you, Lord, that you have given me life and life more abundantly. Thank you, Lord, you have made me most blessed. I am exceedingly glad in your presence. I trust you, Lord. So if I trust you, then I must obey you and do what is right. Now, is there anything too hard for you, Lord? No, a thousand times no. Then he says to teach the people and their descendants to live the way the Lord wants them to live, to live right, to live justly. The just shall live by faith. Then the Lord will give what he has promised. Help me to live by faith, Lord. Help me to live right so that you can give me the desire of my heart. Thank you, Lord, that you are just, that you do right. Thank you, Lord, that as I delight myself in you, you give me the desires of my heart. And the desire of my heart is to preach the gospel, heal the sick, cast out demons, reap the harvest. Thank you, Lord, that surely, Garen's ball barons, you will testify of yourself with signs, wonders, miracles, and gifts of the Holy Spirit. The word for today is desire. Thank you, Lord, for giving us our heart's desire and fulfilling all our purpose. God bless. Check in tomorrow.